I'm endlessly interested in those kind of different ways of being and seeing that the natural world offers. I've always liked the image of life being a form of falling. I, I, I like the way the human body sort of approaches the earth as it ages, bends, and then kind of flops into the grave. And I'm very interested in those kind of inadvertent actions like falling awake and falling asleep and what happens to the mind when you have to sort of give in to something like that, which to me is very like what it's like writing a poem. You have to kind of faint or fall into it. I simply am listening out for two opposing things, and one is the kind of destabilizing, destructive energy of sensations as they pass, and the other is the kind of melody that the mind provides that sort of holds things steady for a moment. And if that's a poem, I don't know, but that's, that's mostly what I'm working with. <laughs> Water, which is so raw, so earthy strong, and lurks in cast iron tanks, and leaks along, drawn under gravity towards my tongue, to cool and fill the pipework of this song, which is the story of the falling rain that rises to the light and falls again. <laughs> 